What's up, guys? Welcome back to The Garage. Another trailer reaction today. Another horror trailer reaction. A movie that I have heard whisperings about over the last year or so. And it's finally happening. Another movie based on a very popular American holiday. The movie is simply going to be called Thanksgiving. Directed by Mr. Eli Roth, who we know is a horror guru. You've got Blood Rage. Please don't forget about Blood Rage. Look that film up if you're not familiar with it. A great Thanksgiving slasher from the 80s. You also have a kind of cheesy, schlocky B-movie from the early 2000s called Thanks Killing, which takes place over the holiday with a murderous turkey. Yes, look that up if you want some laughs. But I've been really looking forward to this one, and I haven't watched the trailer yet. I know it's a teaser. It's only about a minute long. Let's watch the trailer together, the teaser for Thanksgiving, and then I'll give you some thoughts at the end here. And play? Oh, I hate when they do a trailer for the trailer or like an intro. Just play it. Thanksgiving is a time for appreciation. It's a good looking bird. It's a time to remember our many blessings. To celebrate with the ones that we love the most. Okay. And it's time for all families to be together. So sh a shot of the possible mass there. That's it. That's all I need. Woo! Like I said, that's all I need. Eli Roth, who is a filmmaker, yes, but I really like his movies because he's a horror fanatic like us, like me. So it's cool that he's able to kind of take that from fandom to creator and give us this art. He's done some stuff that's been kind of wishy-washy, love it or hate it kind of movies in the past. But I'm really looking forward to Thanksgiving. And I don't know, that did not have the grindhouse aesthetic that I was expecting. It was a much more polished, modern, clearly, or it seems like present day setting. I don't know if you guys know that this is essentially spawned from a fake trailer from the grindhouse Robert Rodriguez, Quentin Tarantino film that came out back in 2007, I think. No leftovers. And there was a lot of fake trailers in there. We also got Machete. So there was a fake trailer for Thanksgiving. And it also had that tagline, there will be no leftovers. And it kind of turned into this thing that's been 16 years now in the making. And we're finally getting it a, a theatrical release of this horror film. I saw Patrick Dempsey pop up in there. There was a quick shot of that plastic kind of pilgrim mask that may be worn by the killer in the movie. What I also like is the simplicity. And I hope they make it a very simple story here like the initial halloween movie obviously given its name from the popular holiday was just michael myers stalking a babysitter nobody knew why of course as the series went on it started to try to fill those plot lines together it didn't really need to the simplicity and the ambiguity there is what i really really like and then you're just attaching the familiarity of this holiday to that and it's just a slasher it's just this guy killing people on thanksgiving who knows? Maybe somebody had one too many political statements at the dinner table. We don't know. Are you excited to see it? I am. It's not the same aesthetic that I thought I was going to get. I thought I was going to get that grindhouse 70s, 80s vintage kind of feel, almost like a Ty West type deal. But that's not what I saw in that trailer. But that's okay. I'm still very excited for it. I'm glad it was, it was a teaser. I don't think it gave too much away. Let me know what you thought of the trailer down below in the comments, horror fans. I'm excited for this one. I'll see you guys next time in the garage.